yeah. We're grilling, baby. Nice olive garden. Garlic and herb. Nice steak pork chop. Couple of pepper burgers. Let's get grilling. We're grilling with Maddie J. We got some nice, lovely Hugo Horn music coming from my neighbor. She makes it such a lovely experience. So, let's keep grilling. Once again, this is Matty J out at the grill. Nice 65 something degree weather day. Doing a little grilling. A couple of pepper burgers. And a nice steak pork chop with some Olive Garden garlic and herb spices on it. We're going to close this grill up for a moment here. And let them burgers cook a little bit more. We moved that pork chop aside. Seems to be doing quite well. So let's work on them burgers right now. And well, we're coming down to the home stretch, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Maddie J, cooking on the grill. Just put some uh, grain bread up on top. I'm gonna toast that up for them nice little burgers that are coming along nice and good. Look at that steak, let's get a close up. Ah. Oh. Nice flame broiled burgers, not quite done, still a little pink. Gotta make sure you get all of that pink out. Nice bread up there, toasting up nicely. We're gonna give this a few more minutes, but we're gonna leave the, the hood open right now just to control our temperature. Right about when these are just about done, we're gonna throw two pieces of jalapeno pepper cheese right on top of them burgers. And then we're gonna take them inside. We're gonna put some nice mayonnaise on there, some nice Duke's mayonnaise, and some nice lettuce. And we're gonna have a good meal. Be back shortly, gentlemen, in the due time. All right, just a couple of more flips. Nice plain broiled pepper burgers. Take a look at a nice jalapeno pepper cheese here. One for you. One for you. And let's give this one last flip right there. Oh, yes. Toasty over there. And actually, with every grill, you can get your hot spots, you get your cooler spots. You just gotta learn how to work with what you got. Okay, look at that cheese, nice and melted. I've already turned the propane off on the grill. 
always make sure you turn the propane off. I like to personally turn my propane off my tank first. And then close my uh, ignition valves. So there's no leftover propane in the lines. And well, we're going to go put this on that over there. Well, not the cell phone. Uh, and we're going to bring this inside. And we're going to get eaten. And with a little more magic of time, we're going to have some nice seasoned curly fries. Back over here is where a little magic is going to start happening. Got some nice Duke's mayonnaise. Some nice spicy brown mustard. Of course, like I said, some lettuce. We're going to throw on some ketchup. And the magic dish over here just waiting to get served up. And we're coming down to the end. We just got to add that nice lettuce to it. All right. And there we have it. All finished up. <clears throat> nice little seasoned fries. Thank you for watching. Maddie J. Cooking on the Grill. Don't forget to like, subscribe, ring that bell if you'd like to see more videos. Have a wonderful afternoon. Bye-bye for now.